Hey guys, I'm Nick Akita, one of my next games today. I'm reaching you guys how to install the paintball mod in Minecraft 1.8, allowing you to get paintball guns and tons of awesome other stuff. So let's go ahead and jump on into this. First off, we need to go to slatebit.com slash it doesn't matter. First thing in the description down below, go down there, click that. It will take you up to this page where you want to click on downloads right here. It will drop us down to where it says downloads. We want to click universal files. It will then take us off to add file where we have to wait five seconds. In these five seconds, I'm going to send these. If you have any issues with that file, Simply right click on your browser and reload. If that doesn't work for you, Google how to enable cookies on whatever browser you have. Follow the tutorials there, come back and it should work. If that doesn't work, I'm sorry, there's nothing else I can do. Adfly some of these creators have to use to make a little bit of money back for all of the work they put into their mods. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and click skip ad up here. It will then take us off to this page where we can choose what we want to download here. What version of Paintball Mod. And for us, we want 1.8, so we're going to click on 1.8 right here. We will click that and it will automatically download the Paintball Mod. Now we're not done downloading stuff yet. We still need to download Forge or from files.minecraftforge.net or the second link in the description down below. Go down there, click that. Takes us here. We want to scroll down to 1.8 recommended and then go all the way over until we see installer. Click on installer. It will again take us off to AdFly where we again have to wait five seconds, but this time I don't have to give you the little AdFly spiel, so we have to go ahead and click skip ad now. It will then download Forge, which we do want to keep. Once we've done that, we can now minimize our browser, and boom, we've got two files, Paintball and Forge. So, what do we want to do with these? Well, first off, if they're on your desktop, at the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time. Type in Downloads, hit Enter, and they will be here in your Downloads folder. If they are, simply click them and drag them to your desktop just for ease of use. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and open up Forge first, because it's easier. So, right-click on Forge. We want to open with Java TM Platform SE Binary. It will then open up a handy little installer that we can see here. Click Install Client, click OK. It'll go through, download some stuff, do some things, and woohoo! Successfully installed Client Profile Forge. Awesome! Go ahead and click OK, and now we can delete the Forge file we downloaded. Now we're not quite done yet. We need to go ahead and uh, install the Paintball mod because that's why we're really here, right? So let's go ahead and right click on that. Now for me, I'm going to be extracting files. For you, you might be unzipping files. Either way, it doesn't matter. You want to extract or unzip whichever one you have. Click on that, go through the menus, click OK, apply, yes, all that stuff, and boom, you get this folder. Now we can delete this scary zip file. Let's go ahead and drag it over here to the recycling bin. Now, if we open up Paintball, we will have, boom, right there, Paintball-1.8.0. We want to take that, drag that to our desktop, and now we can delete this folder, and now we can install the Paintball mod. To do that, hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time. Type in percent, APP, DATA, percent, percent, app data, percent. Hit enter, it will take us here, we want to go into .minecraft, and then we want to go into our mods folder, but what if we don't have a mods folder, Nick, what do we do? Well, don't freak out, simply right click over here in the white space, create new folder, and title it mods, M-O-D-S, all lowercase. Go ahead and now open your newly created folder and drag paintball right into it. Now all we want to do is come up here to games. Go into Minecraft, Minecraft, and uh, basically open up the Minecraft Launcher. That's what you're doing right now. So, we're going to open the Minecraft Launcher. Once we're here, there's some more stuff you need to do. Select the profile you want to play. In my case, that's Nick's Games. Hit Edit Profile. Then we want to come down here to where it says Use Version. Click on the box right here, right next to it. And then scroll all the way down to the bottom, where you can will see Release 1.8 Forge. Right there. See that? Click that. Click Save Profile. Click Play. It will now open up Minecraft Forge, or Minecraft with Forge installed in 1.8. Took me a second to get there, but we did get there. Now, as you can see, it'll open up black screen, no problem. Black screens are fine, just let it load its things, and then Mojang, and then it will take us to the main menu, where we will be able to uh, show you guys that uh, this is installed. Now, there's a few ways to do this. You can go into Mods here, and it will be right there, as you can see, Paintball, but that's not good enough for me, so let's go ahead and go into a world. I didn't mean to go into this world. I'm actually going to have to back out and go into another one. <laughs> Is my bad. I'm sorry about that. So let's go ahead and immediately save and quit to title on that because that wasn't creative and we need creative to be able to do this correctly. Which we don't have a creative world. Come on, Nick. Get it together. There we go. Create a new world and now be able to show you guys this mod is actually installed. You should already know if it's installed at this point, but I just want to show you guys that it is working for me as well. That way you know I'm not trying to cheat you or anything like that because I would never do something like that to you guys. So let's go ahead, download this terrain and come on. Hurry up. Hurry up. 
I've noticed that Forge One Daddy does have some problems creating and downloading new terrain. Maybe that's a Forge One Daddy problem. Maybe that's a Minecraft One Daddy problem. I don't know. But um, it's actually going to take a minute here. So I will see you guys on the other side of a jump cut, and we'll be good to go. And we've loaded the terrain. So now what we're going to do is come into our search menu here and type, say, gun for paintball gun. We can go ahead and get this and right click. We don't have any paintballs, do we? Oh, no, it looks like that's working. Looks like we are now shooting paintballs. Awesome. We can also come in here. We've got things such as, I think, paintbrushes. Yep, look at that. Boom, paintbrushes right here, which uh, I don't know exactly what these would do, but I think they will paint on other players and things like that. This is honestly a mod that works best on a server. I will admit that for you guys, but luckily you've got to install it locally for a server, so if you've been having trouble joining a server because you don't have a paintball mod, well then there you go. I've also got a tutorial that I'll link in the description of this video and at the end of the video here on the end slate, so you guys will be able to know how to set up a server and install mods on it with Forge. That way you'll be able to play this with your friends if you want to. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out guys. Peace. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. Down that way, we've got how to start a Forge server. Want to play paintball with your friends? Well, there you go. That's how you can do it. And down the other way, we've got Sky Factory. That's an uh, epic, awesome, modded Let's Play series that you guys will really enjoy. Go check it out. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Nick's Games, and I'm out, guys. Peace.